welcome to our new home rental. We have a lot to go through still, as you can tell, but it's been about two weeks now. We've gotten a lot done and cleared up a whole lot of boxes. Yeah! This is our check-in status of our move-in. Take a look. Okay, friends. This entry is a lot better than it used to be, y'all. Office is one of the last rooms down here to get finished. We have a lot of work to do here. There's Megan's editing station where you all get to enjoy Megan's editing skills of these videos. DC's workstation. We have our sewing arts and crafts station. Sewing stuff here. Oh, it doesn't want to focus for you. There we go. Lots of arts and crafts because this household loves arts and crafts. Of course, we have the puppies playing with their ball. Where's your ball? Go get it. So as you can see, st oh, this thing does not want to focus. Slow, maybe I have to move slowly. All our luggage from all of our travels is now emptied and ready to be stored. A lot of clothes being washed and dried. And we have our budding artists right here doing work. As you can see, we have no furniture yet. The only furniture we have is our beds. The only thing we have is beds. Why isn't this focusing? This is really, what is the deal? Okay, over here we have a whole bunch of donate, giveaway, or sell, all of this stuff. Over there, you'll see is a little area for puppies. It's intentional for puppies. Perfect for these two little puppies, that's their home. We did install or get air cleaners for every room in this house. As you can tell, it does a thorough job. Right now it's cleaning. It shouldn't be orange, it should be blue. So, our room is minimal. We got a bed and that's it. And a whole lot of blankets. The bathroom is clean, the closet is clean. I don't know how up close and personal you want to be, but I will show you the kitchen because this was chaos. All along here is all the homeschool curriculum for all the kids, all ready to go. They each have their own bin. And this is the kitchen. It is done. We are done. It's kind of messy right now. Excuse the mess. But you know, that's life. These cabinets though make me happy. What do we have up here? We have all of our baking cooling racks because we love to bake cookies, especially pizza. Those are the things for the holidays. Down here they have a nice little pull out. That's for all of our baking sheets. In here we have all of our cutlery nicely organized as best as we possibly can. I don't know how to get these to stay. Every time this door shuts, this thing moves forward. I need to get some sticky grips for the bottom of this. Right now I just put no liners, so paper towel for now. That down there will be our bake, our cooking stuff. More cooking stuff. And again, another cabinet that makes me happy to look at. We have no liners. Instead we use paper towel. Cheap. Here's miscellaneous. We have our glass, our goblets up there. Uh, we have two different mugs. <laughs> One from Starbucks and one from DC's old work and a whole bunch of travel mugs and our blender bottles for mixing our protein shakes. We have our cutting boards which are being oiled right now. Take good care of your cutting boards so they don't split y'all. All right, and another cabinet that semi makes me happy. I don't know. We do not need all these mugs, but we do. We have all these mugs and glasses. It's just that the sets I got came with mugs and so you end up with a lot of mugs. I needed all the plates and bowls. I don't need all these mugs, but we do like to drink our teas and hot chocolates and whatnot. And finally down here, this is gonna be the drink station. We have our tea, we're tea, tea drinkers. And down here, I'm trying out this new protein meal replacement. I will definitely be diving more into this in the new year, but I taste tested this and it is delicious, y'all. 
here's the entry we found these packed up these are all of our valentine mailboxes yes valentine mailboxes and we have a recipe keeper that i have professionally put together we'll go through that another time all right and check out the laundry room y'all <laughs> i'm excited about this you can actually walk into the laundry room all right so we still have a lot i have to take all of my jackets all of these wool coats smell musty they've been in them and my leather jackets not doing good they need to go to the dry cleaner and emma the artist show and tell time beautiful that is the update of downstairs upstairs is a lot to go through so we still have a lot to do up there and that is the status update hope you enjoyed today is a big day we are gonna go shopping our pantry is empty do you want to see it it's empty here is our pantry we have a bit of food but mostly empty containers to be filled so because we've been so busy unpacking and unloading we've had to get really quick meals and today's the day the kitchen is finished we can get some real food and do some real cooking all right so let's go shopping right now we're in texas and it's cold today we're freezing still couldn't help ourselves we still picked up some yeah i will i will cold boba, boba. We have the boys with us, <laughs> and now we're gonna head in to our favorite store and do yeah. some shopping well, we and warm up because I'm uh, cold, y'all. Let's go! You comment on this every single time. I, I comment on this every single time because these knives are a steal for that price. A steal! And we have the old ones that we didn't know already that are not as white. She wishes she waited until this price and this updated time. <laughs> if this is shaking, it's because I'm shivering. It's so cold. But yes, I highly recommend these knives. It's a steal. They're really nice. They are very sharp. All right, let's go. Okay, this is what we, have. we do have those cutting boards. Yes, we do. We got them for a steal, though. We got them in when we were taking Annabelle to college for like $15 or something ridiculous for all of them. We did get this set here to organize our drawers and it's working out very, very well. All right, let's get into Costco. This is just the entrance. Oh, we might think about getting this early Christmas present for Tuck and Bella. This is a cute bag that it comes in. Should we get this for them? Oh, there's stuff in there? Yeah. I think we'll pick this up. Let's do it. All right, first purchase. Of course, it's for the spoiled pup pups. We may have to pick up one of these because cleaning out the den, I had to do a lot of shredding and I burnt the motor of our shredder. Oh, this one's an 18 sheet shredder. Ours was 12. I put in 10 sheets. Let me tell you, I put in 10 sheets and it broke on me. Vacuum review right now. We purchased this vacuum. I don't recommend it. I did not like it. It's big, it's clunky. I didn't feel like it was that powerful. It's probably why it's the cheapest vacuum out here. Don't go for the cheapest. Shark is gonna be a much better option. That's my opinion on vacuums. Do not get the Eureka, get the Shark. If you really wanna step it up big time, go for the Dyson. All right, let's go. Does your Costco have Kirkland branded hoodies? If you wanna represent Costco, you get one of these, y'all. Let's go check out the rest of Costco, Megan. I'm training the little Padawans to be Costco shoppers. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job. Okay, so we're picking up this small kitty table. 1997. We haven't made it very far here in Costco. We're slow shoppers. We have two carts. By the end of this shopping extravaganza, they will most likely be filled. Okay, we're gonna pick up some Fuji apples. $9.99 for four pounds. We like Fuji apples. We are also going to pick up some of these mandarin oranges here. Oh. Okay, let's pick up some orange or oranges. These look like oranges. Why don't they call these yellows? Okay, I'll put it in yours. I'll put it in. There we go. Megan, we're gonna pick up some ginger, okay? It's organic. 
When I pick things up, I always, I can never get the one that's closest and on top. I always have to go below or behind. Something my dad always taught me when I went shopping with him, he always say, don't get the first one. Go behind and get the next one. Sweet potatoes. We like sweet potatoes. And if you've watched one of our last Costco hauls, I like to roast up a whole big batch. And my grandma, I'll probably always say this, the first time I had a cold sweet potato that was baked out of her fridge, I thought it was like ice cream. It was so yummy and super healthy. Try it. Bake it off, stick it in the fridge on a hot day, having a cold sweet potato. Mmm, tasty. If you like sweet potatoes, it will be really good. I'm getting two bags. Ooh, and they're on sale. These baby potatoes, roast them off in the oven with some salt and olive oil, and they are tasty. Crispy on the outside, creamy on the inside. I usually roast this entire bag, and we almost consume an entire tray of these. Don't we, Meg? They're delicious. Okay. Let's get some mushrooms. We're gonna get these organic baby Bellas. Is it gonna go in your cart? Okay, Ethan's gonna go put it in his cart. Mushrooms ah. on the list. Oh, wrong, oh, wrong car, baby! <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna get some organic, already peeled garlic. This is the way to go if you wanna be quick and fast and still have a lot of flavor. And I'm gonna give you a tip. If you don't go through this entire bag, a tip is I usually ro sheet roast a whole pan of these and you have roasted garlic puree and you can freeze it. You can freeze your roasted garlic and add it to anything. Try it, it's a good tip. If you've watched our other Costco hauls, you know this is my favorite ground beef to get here at Costco. It's the organic ground beef here. $4.97, it's a really good, a good deal. Cause you know, organic is always expensive, more expensive, but Costco has a good deal on their organic ground beef. Try it, it's good. This organic chicken, it feels partially frozen, so yeah. If it's too much for you, take it apart and freeze it in more smaller portions, but we're a big family, so we will utilize this entire package. We like this stuff, and guess what? It's on sale, so we will pick this up. You can do so many things with this. You can add it to flavor a sauce or just with crackers. One or two? Megan says two. You add this in with your mashed potatoes. Delicious. Try it. Okay, let's go. We bought this the last time we were at Costco and gave it a go, and it was not a thumbs up. The kids thought it was, what, too salty? Yeah. Too salty. You might like it, but we, we pass. We pass on that one. The kids love these non breads, the mini ones. All right, we're gonna pick up this organic almond milk. It's heavy. There we go. My little helper right there. Water here at Costco has gone up in price since we first started buying for sure for 19 but still fantastic deal for how many do you get 40. <gasps> Ooh, their laundry detergent is still on sale let's, pe let's pack some in that's an excellent price 11.99 i think they were like 9.99 when we first bought these doubled in price yeah we've got to get some of these for our puppy apartment we are halfway through Costco. We have two carts that are half filled. Let's get into the refrigerated section. Kids really like these almond flour tortillas. If you are gluten free, that's the way to go. We're gonna grab two of them. They have these Annie's organic cinnamon rolls. Oh, they're discontinued. Yes. Oh, bummer, we're gonna have to get some. You wanna get some? Are they delicious? Do they get a thumbs up? Okay, Megan, you wanna grab some before they no longer have them? Let's get two of them. We're all about the going in doubles. No limit, but 
but we'll get two. So he thinks it's double. I'm getting the one in front. <laughs> That's too hard to dig. Kids like to wrap these with the croissants that I just purchased to make little piggies in the blanket. We're gonna give these a try. We've never tried them. They are currently $9.97 with a star, which means they're getting rid of them. So that can mean either they're really not good or they're just getting rid of them because nobody's buying them. So we shall see. Let's get some organic almond butter. And by the way, if you see a green label that represents organic and Costco is pretty good about carrying organic stuff. Mom, there's peanut butter right here. Yeah, that, that's, that, that's cheaper, but guess what? It has a lot of sugar and we don't want you eating a lot of sugar, kids. Here's your sugar alternative, Megan. Would you like some of this erythritol monk fruit? I wish it was just monk fruit, but you know. I know how much you love sugar, but we're gonna get the healthy sugar, okay? I'm gonna use sugar as much as possible so you can insert sugar right here. Green, organic, and we tasted this. Hadn't tasted it until we bought it a little while ago, and it's delicious. If you like garlic, marinara sauce, this will be good on pizza, good in your pasta. Chia seeds are amazing. If you haven't tried it, make some chia pudding. You just add some chia seeds to your liquid of choice, usually a milk product, and you have yourself chia pudding. Put it in the fridge overnight or for a few hours, and the gelatin from the chia seeds thickens it up. And you have yourself some healthy, fiber-rich pudding. I usually add these in our holiday green bean casserole. Costco has a large and in charge bag. Currently on sale for $4.79. The sale's almost over though, sorry. Okay, so this bachan, bachans, bachans? Japanese barbecue sauce is like a teriyaki sauce. Joshua loves this stuff. He asked if we could get it. So. He asked if I would get it. I was gonna pass because if you read the ingredients, but I will ignore them because I did get a lot of stuff that you don't want to read the ingredients. But this is really good on rice. It's really good on meat. I recommend it if you like Japanese teriyaki sauce. We're getting these almond flour crackers to go with the cheese that we got earlier. I'm gonna try this out. What is it? Ashwanga? Ashku Ashwagandha. Ashwagandha. Nature's antidote to modern stress. Megan loves this. Should we get some? Should we get some pop and candy? They're so healthy for you. $6.97, y'all. And they actually have popping candy in it. And it, there's fireworks in your mouth. I'll get it for Megan. These almost every time we come to Costco. It's a healthy, clean snack. Best deal for cotton rounds. Keeping your face clean and whatnot. Taking your nail polish off, all those good things. Whenever we come to Costco, we always make a pit stop at the food court, y'all. They're very thorough about checking you out of Costco here. This is the most thorough check job that I've ever received coming to this Costco every time. Did you get a happy face? Yep, you always get a happy face coming to Costco. What's the total? How much did we spend at Costco? What did we spend? Over $600, y'all, for all of this stuff. Easy to do at Costco. Easy to do. Okay, friends. Thank you so much for coming shopping with us. We really appreciate you watching. Thank you for watching. And as always, we send you our love and appreciation. Mwah! The dogs so far really like their toys from Costco. These spoiled puppies. Oh, he loves clean fetch. Oh, they're both going after it. <laughs> oh, Tuck brought it back. Good boy, Tuck. Let's make good. <laughs>